Western intelligence shows Russia is amassing aircraft at the border with Ukraine, an indication that Moscow could throw its jets and helicopters into the war to support a stuttering land offensive. The fear of a looming air war in Ukraine has prompted allies to prioritize rapid shipments of air defense assets and artillery ammunition to Kyiv, Western officials said, to respond to the shift in approach by Moscow as the almost year-long war enters a new phase. Intelligence shared among NATO allies show that Russia is amassing fixed-wing and rotary aircraft on the border with Ukraine, according to two officials briefed on its contents. In meetings with allied countries supporting Ukraine on Tuesday, U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin highlighted the threat of Russia's significant remaining air force. Quote, he was very clear that we have a short window of time to help the Ukrainians to prepare for an offensive and that they have some pretty specific needs, a senior U.S. administration official said. The Russian land forces are pretty depleted, so it's the best indication that they will turn this into an air fight. If the Ukrainians are going to survive, they need to have as many air defense capabilities and as much ammunition as possible, the official added. In a news conference later on Tuesday, Austin said the U.S. did not see imminent signs of a massive aerial attack from Russia on Ukraine, but that Washington and its allies are rushing as much air defense capability to the country as they possibly can. Quote, we do know Russia has substantial aircraft and a lot of capability left, Austin said. Ukraine's current air defenses were not enough, and we're going to need to keep pushing until we get more because that threat is out there, he said. And we want to make sure that they have the ability to protect themselves in the event Russia decides to introduce its air force into the fight. We'll keep you updated on these developments. This is coming from FT.com. Stay with TNS, Texas News Studio. Leave your comments below, and we'll talk to you soon at the next report.